Hi, I'm Mark Ramey, editor-at-large for Runner's World and author of the Runner's Rulebook. I'm here to talk to you a little bit about the snot rocket, or farmer's blow. Why do you need to learn how to do the farmer's blow? Because it can make your running a lot more enjoyable, particularly in colder months, when noses start to run and get clogged up, maybe you're running with a head cold or something like that, and uh, as anyone who runs will tell you, it's a lot more pleasant to run with your passageways, including your nose, all free and open, as opposed to clogged up and mucusy and runny. One, this is an outdoor tip. If you're on the treadmill at the gym, you're gonna to wanna to use a tissue, not the farmer's blow, trust me. Two, here's a rule of thumb. If you're outdoors and walking around with a stuffed up nose and you're wearing street clothes like I am, Again, best to use a tissue or a hanky or anything else, uh, or just wait till you get home to take care of this. The farmer's blow when you're wearing a three-piece suit is uh, not so good. Three, and this is the most important one by far, right before you perform the blow itself, what you need to do is look around you and make sure that everything is clear. You're going to want to mark off a sort of a mental three or four feet blast radius around you with you at the center because you don't want to incur any collateral damage with your flying mucus when you're performing the blow. Finally, how do you do it? The good news is it's really pretty simple. It's five really easy steps and I'm going to quote directly from the runner's rule book, rule 1.18. One, breathe in through your mouth almost like you're gasping. Two, lay a forefinger against one nostril and compress firmly. Three, purse your lips. Four, cock your head slightly in the direction of the open nostril and exhale forcefully through your nose. Fifth and finally, repeat with the opposite nostril if necessary. So that's it, the farmer's blow. Hope you enjoyed it. One final note, don't be discouraged if you don't nail this right away. Like anything in life, practice makes perfect. Done well, a farmer's blow is a marvel to behold and will make your running a lot more enjoyable. Done wrong and you'll have a real mess on your hands. I'm Mark Ramey, thanks again for watching and I'll see you on the roads, just three to four feet away.